Hello, I'm Texas Agriculture Commissioner Todd Staples, and I'm excited to welcome you to the growing and dynamic world of Texas Organics. Texas produces a variety of organic products from vegetables and fruits to cotton and rice to beef and dairy, all on more than 300,000 acres of farm and ranch land. We all know everything is bigger and better in Texas, and that includes the dynamic organic industry. What's growing in Texas these days? Just about anything you like, including healthy organic products. Texans have the freedom to choose organic or conventionally grown products, or enjoy both. Just about anything you can think of that's being grown conventionally in Texas is being grown organically now. When you see the USDA organic logo, it means the farmer has followed strict operating guidelines to make sure you have a true organic product. In organic farming, you, you cannot use any synthetic chemicals. So you can't use man-made uh, fertilizers or man-made pesticides or herbicides. If you choose to purchase organic products, you can find a wide variety of foods from broccoli to beef at your local farmer's market or supermarket. Except for maybe salt and pepper, you really could get things that you eat all the time at the farmer's market. And organics are not limited to food. You'll also find body care products made from organic ingredients, and even clothing made from organic cotton. What should you look for when buying organics? Really what you want to not worry about so much is the cosmetic damage that's on the skin, or maybe even the shape of the product, and really start thinking about what's inside. Another way Texans are getting organic products is through CSAs, where members and volunteers help support the farm that produces their food. CSA stands for Community Supported Agriculture, and what that means is that our customers have a direct relationship with our farm. All the money that CSA's members pay for goes uh, directly back to our farm. It is meant that the gentleman in this property has gone from having three jobs to support his family to being able to do it with his CSA. People volunteer here for a lot of different reasons. In general, I think they all just really enjoy, you know, being outside for a morning and then they go home with a big box of vegetables. So there are wonderful ways for people to be involved in tending the food that we end up eating. By participating in that process, and tending the life that feeds our own life, we become much more in tune with the land. Organic products may cost a little more, but they're worth it to a growing number of Texans. And as demand for organics increases, so does the number of organic producers. It's really been a, a, a market that I think has grown as much as 10, 15 percent a year every year. The financial rewards are secondary to knowing that I'm doing something that is providing a good food source for those who want it. Through the Texas Organic Cotton Marketing Co-op, High Plains farmers produce about 95 percent of U.S. organic cotton. Texas is the third largest organic milk producing state and increased production of organically grown feed in the state supplies livestock and poultry farms. Organic farming is becoming a popular choice among farmers who want to use natural means to control pests, fertilize crops, and reduce water use. You know, you see earthworms coming back and things in the soil that we, you know, we haven't seen in a long time. You know, we're planting this 80 acres here and 200 acres across the road. The reality is, is that our kids and grandkids will, will enjoy eating those pecans. Texas producers are a growing part of the organic movement that is taking root throughout the United States. When you prepare a piece of land, planting the seed and, and cultivating it and, and watching it grow and then preparing to harvest that crop, it's almost spiritual in a way because of the connection you have with nature. The farmer that planted the seed is the farmer that's going to hand you that carrot. More and more people are feeling like they need that connection to the land and to the soil and to the seed. Just look for the Go Texan logo to be sure your organic products are from the Lone Star State. People recognize that logo and know it's from Texas and, and uh, I think Texans like to buy Texas grown products. What we're doing now is to find better ways to educate the consumers about what's available what's being grown in Texas organically, and, and how to uh, obtain it. 
Thank you for taking the time to learn more about Texas Organic Products. I hope you discover how easy it is to find and purchase Texas Organic Products. And remember, always look for the Go Texan logo.